Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mitch from We in Tennessee. Today's video, it's gonna be all about the grass and the yard. So the one thing I've learned, well, I've learned many things since being here in Tennessee, but one of the important things that I've learned about being here in Tennessee is it rains a lot and thus everything is green, but that also means your grass is going to be growing like crazy. Um, I just noticed that, you know, as you drive around, people just take immaculate care of their lawn. Um, I just noticed a lot of riding lawn mowers, the zero turn and just the regular riding lawn mowers. We could not afford those riding lawn mowers. Our yard definitely would require it, but I use just a regular, you know, push motorized lawn mower. And so it's going to take me a little longer, but it's, um, you know, it, it's new, so it's kind of exciting for me, but I just shudder when it rains because then I'm like, oh no, it's gonna, the grass is gonna grow and I have to head it back out there to, to mow. Um, but it's just interesting that people park their cars outside and they put their lawnmowers in the garage. And it's just one of those things where, I, I don't know, I, we do the same thing. But because we have so many boxes in here that we have to go through and they're we're just lucky that they're not in storage, but we couldn't fit our cars in here anyway. So it's just a cool thing to just know, hey, people take a lot of pride in their yard. Um, I just wish we didn't have to mow as often as we do because it's a pretty big yard and it takes a lot of time and effort and sweat. So today the yard is um, pretty overgrown. We actually have to end up doing ours in sections like this section one day this section another day you're right it gets a little tiring but today i'm just going to head to the overgrown part and get that thing knocked out and hopefully you know the neighbors approve you just don't want the neighbors looking at your lawn going oh my gosh the neighborhood's beautiful except for that house but anyway i'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like before and then show you the after Okay guys, so here is the part that I got to mow today and I got to mow behind me also. But this part just gets crazy long and it doesn't take much to get this thing getting overgrown. So I'm going to go ahead and get this thing mowed and show you what it looks like when it's done. So here is the before. Okay guys, I was going to take video of myself mowing, but it's so hot out here, my phone kept saying that it's too hot to video record, so I'm just going to show you the end product of what it looks like now. Yeah, you're right, I'm going to have to edge this side over here, but for today, I'm just going to mow because I am dying and it is in the mid-90s right now, so I'm going to, I'm going to get out of this heat. Okay, this is just part of the section of our yard that I just did. It's satisfying to see the, the lawnmower lines in the grass. So I'm going to finish this part. I'm going to come over here and knock that out. And then I'm going to go ahead back to the part that I was telling you about. But this is the satisfying part. It looks good, but it's just very hot and humid out here. So I'm going to continue mowing. Okay guys, so I thought I would end this video with some reality and show you what it looks like when you're done mowing when you're using a push mower. And when I say push mower, I got a motor. It's not one of those ones that has the blade, you know, back from the 1950s or whatever. So it's super humid, but we got the job done. And what's satisfying is when you look out the window and see how much better your lawn looks after you're done. I think that's the satisfying part. But don't get me wrong, if somebody could, I don't know, if we were rich enough to pay somebody to do it, I think we would. But it's at the end of the day, it's satisfying to just know that you're taking care of the lawn. And, you know, when you drive by, you're like, yes, I did that. But I'm going to go into the house now and get something really cold to drink. It is so hot out here. So I'm not going to candy coat this. It's not one of those... You know, you get off the riding lawnmower, it's like, ah, piece of cake. It's hot and um, my hands are, are getting numb because you're, you're holding on to that thing. And, you know, 
you guys know how it is, I think. Anyway, um, so today was all about the lawn and I just realized it's, it's super important out here. I constantly see people driving around with, you know, their zero turn lawnmowers in the back. So many lawn services because they just know people want their lawn to look good. And if they can't take care of themselves, they're going to get somebody who can take care of it. But it's for the moment, something that we're just doing. You guys know I'm embracing Tennessee, so we're embracing everything about it. And that's if that means lawn care, it means lawn care. But right now I need a cold drink and a shower. So if you guys are new to the channel, my name is Mitch. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that bell because I do my darndest to bring you guys videos every Wednesday and Saturdays. So hit that bell so that way every time I upload a video, you will be notified. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and encouraging me on this journey because I'm still on this journey learning something new every day. Okay, guys, so before I leave you, I'm going to let you take a little drive around with me on Vintage Village. It's a really cool, small little place where there's some really cool houses. Okay, check this out. I'll see you in my next video.